hearts, which are beating, each one beating for each of the dragons. Follow the beating of that heart to find the dragon that belongs to you. And uh, you don't fight it. These are your friends. These are your brothers. Um, but they're trying to kill you. So you have to dodge, weave, and, and uh, duck your way in to where, where they are uh, to, so you can find their, their opening to give them their heart back and restore them to uh, their health. Life. For a piece of the valley. And then the clock. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you, Darren. Oh. Right. Any, any additional support or are you good? Uh, yeah. You could probably use an artist. We'll never see another one artist. <laughs> I'm going to try to do better next year to try to get the artists excited. Okay. <laughs> All right, who would you want to share next? I'll go. Thank you. Okay, so our idea is that it's going to be a text-based game, and the concept is, is that you are the head, like you're the computer, and you're the head of a hospital wing of spaceship. That's your job. Your job is to keep humans alive. Okay, and so you're, you're going through, you do different diagnostics on them, you have to figure out what makes them healthy, what keeps them alive. But then, as you start learning more and more about them, you realize they're different than you. They're different from a computer. A human is inherently different. What is it that makes a human inherently different from a computer? A heart. And so it's your quest from then on to find a heart and to try to become almost human, better understand. Excellent. Thank you. Do you need any resources? Do you guys need any resources, any other particular skills on your team? They don't know yet. Let them back up for Thank you. There are people wandering lost. Yeah, there's people wandering lost in the process. All right.